morning. Welcome to the Jag Corner. I'm sorry I'm running slow. I was definitely uh, a lot of duct tape this morning to get things working. For some reason, my camera just didn't want to work. Um, so, but I got it working. Had to fiddle around with the. Basically, I re, uh, set up all my. Tools. Going in and editing the actual JSON file that saves um, when you're set up. And and yeah, that didn't work <laughs> either. So, um, anyways, uh, I think I got everything shared out. Uh, uh, I haven't thought too much about news or anything, so let's go check that out really quick. There, nothing's coming to mind immediately. Um, my audio even working? Hey, my audio. Yeah, my audio is working. I just need to turn down the Jags audio. I'm, I feel a little, my audio feels a little soft, a little quiet. One second. Let me know if there is any problems with the audio. I'm going to turn this up a bit. That should help. Hopefully I'm not getting any nasty feedback. I really should take a listen, but if there's anything, uh, really off with the audio let me know in the chat okay let's see here um, oh yeah so uh, just some things I've talked about before in previous uh, previous streams but there's this 8-bit slicks I did the box art for this one um, it's a uh, it looks like a, a just a kart racer which is kind of appropriate for what we're doing today we're doing world tour racing by the way I should have said that at the beginning. We're doing World Tour Racing, which is uh, an Atari Jaguar CD game that came out. And if I had to assume, right, probably after the Jag went down. I'm not entirely sure. It's definitely in 95. I don't think there's any way it came out any sooner than that. Um, but yeah, uh, yeah, this is available for order. It's for the links. This isn't the game we're playing today, but uh, it's, it's a similar uh, F1. They call those F1 racers, right? Uh, that's what we're going to be racing today. So, uh, what's cool about 8-Bit Slicks is it's cross-platform multiplayer. So, with the right hardware, this 8-Bit Hub. Oh, it looks like he has that up on his site. Now, I don't remember him having that. Um, you can play these games online, uh, which is awesome. Uh, with other platforms, which include the Commodore 64, the NES, the Atari 8-Bit consoles or computers. Um... The Atari 8-bit computers, not consoles. Uh, what else? Oh, the Apple II. And then there's some other um, computers, personal computers, I'm not familiar with because I think they were Europe only. Uh, like the uh, Acorn Archimedes, I think that's one of them, if I remember right. There's probably more information. Um, no, he doesn't have a website or anything here. Uh, so there's a website that talks more about... Oh, there it is. Unity. Connection, not private. Well, we're not going there. Not now, anyways. Uh, and that leads back to his same website. That's interesting. Okay. Anyways, uh, that's that's available for pre-order. Uh, definitely get in on that action if you have a links. Definitely worth the time and the money. Uh, I don't know if there's anything else. Um, let's see here. Oh! Here's a, a little bit of news. I don't, if you haven't been following this, uh, but a Humble Bazooka, who do, uh, they've put together some other Atari Jaguar peripherals. Uh, the one I can think of, the one I've bought recently, and I've actually talked about on stream a little bit, is just a, a multi-input output device, which have been released before. The, what makes their specials, what makes theirs special is that there is a switch on it. So if you have a game drive, you can turn off the Jag Link while it's booting, and then you can turn it on afterwards so you can do multiplayer with the um, the Jaguar GD, so the flash card. Um, but they just, well, and it looks like it's already out of stock, so maybe I shouldn't talk about this, but, <laughs> oh, it looks like for UK buyers, there may be some luck. Nope, that's sold too. Um, let's just make sure. 
that they're sold out. Yeah, it looks like they are sold out because they don't. They only have the one thing up for sale right now. Um, but get on their list. Uh, I have I have a couple of these coming. Uh, I want to test them, um, and I may even do a video on those, a stream on those, just uh, to test out a few different controllers. I don't have a lot of Bluetooth controllers, but I wanted to try this out. I wanted this as an option because uh, when when I play multiplayer with people, the JAG controller is something that you have to get used to, but a lot of people are used to Xbox 360 controller, that style of controller, you know, modern modern console controllers. And so I'm hoping that this will make multiplayer a little more palatable for people. Um, obviously there are games that require the number pad, but um, and I'm not sure if there's a workaround for that. It will be interesting. I don't know what this R and P button is for. haven't read through it entirely yet. Oh. Uh, plug the Bluetooth, reboots the JAG, uh, JAG Bluetooth, P short press, yeah, this is just for syncing things up, pairing things up, um, looks like there's a web, uh, thing to configure the adapter, uh, oh, so you can do custom button layouts and everything, so, and I believe he posted, I may have retweeted this, actually, seems like I did, yeah, right here, where he's actually playing um, Doom with the Bluetooth keyboard on the Jag, so which is cool. Which would be uh, probably a way better way to play it, to tell you the truth. <laughs> I've always prefer preferred Doom with the keyboard. Um, uh, obviously, there's Asteroid coming up, which is another Jag game. Uh, definitely take advantage of that too. But anyways, I don't want to spend too much time with news today because there just hasn't been a whole lot. I don't think there's been much on um, uh, on on the Atari Age forums either. Let's see, really quick. Let's go take a look, just in case there's something that just came in while I was sleeping. Sometimes that happens. Open Laura is still. Uh, I don't know if anybody if they're still working on that, but it's cool to see that. If you want to see. Um, me streaming that, I think it was two streams ago, that I, I featured Open Laura. Somebody hashtagged it on YouTube, so it should be easy to find. Um, uh, I don't know what this Do the Math Jaguar fan page, I'm not familiar with that. Um, Asteroid again, Bluetooth adapter, looks like people are talking about that. Uh, yeah, and Reboot has their new game, Jumping at Shadows, which I believe is just a tentative name, it's not the... Um, may not be the actual name but that's looking pretty cool if you if you're into the whole platformer it d definitely feels like a modern more like a modern platformer just art style um, hey, definitely something to look forward to um, yeah I don't remember anything else so let's let's get to world tour racing um, we haven't played a game in a couple weeks so this should be uh, this should be pretty good um, I'm going to resituate myself. I have kind of a... Hi, can you beat my lap record on Monaco? World Tour Racing. <laughs> Hi, Matt. How you doing? Bullet 21. Uh, you know what? We'll give it a try right now. <laughs> I haven't played this game. So I, I played it yesterday just to, uh, you know, prep for the stream. Uh, excuse me while I adjust my mic. This might make a little bit of a hum. I have a bit of a grounding issue here, I learned recently um let me switch over to the let's play oh we got to watch this intro really quick in fact i'm going to turn the volume up teak i assume that's how you say that teak you it's T-E-Q-U-E, -E, I believe, not B-E. They're the same people that made uh, Brutal Sports. Um, anyways, really cool. Uh, the FMVs in this game actually aren't distracting like a lot of games at this point in time. Um, and, and so they're, they're actually really enjoyable. They're very well put together, uh, especially for the time. They're very well put together. Uh, great. This game has good music, too. Anyways, I played this a little bit um, yesterday to get to make sure I wouldn't look like a complete noob playing this game today, and I don't think I've played this game in over 10 years. 
it's it's easily been over 10 years uh, and I forgot how good it was I've never been into racing games I've never enjoyed them that much um, and so I'm but this one I found uh, I'm not gonna say it's a great racing game but it's not bad either uh, in fact what I'm I'm thinking about doing two days of this we'll see we'll see how far we go I'm starting my stream rel uh, relatively early I usually start at 7 so I'm gonna play for at least an hour and and then we'll see we'll see wh where we'll go from there I, I'm thinking actually about doing power drive rally tomorrow because I've always enjoyed power power drive rally again I'm not great at racing games um, but I do like power drive rally there's something uh, there's something charming about power drive rally that I really enjoy okay let's see here Monaco which I've never played well I probably played it when I when I was a kid but I might as well I might as well say I've never played it um, we should do a single race if we're gonna pick a specific one Monaco. oh I like how the FMVs they freeze frame and they become the background it's really cool uh, and I I forgot that this game is two-player um, I really should get one of my brothers down here to come play with us let's see here more let's find Monaco Monaco that's probably how you say it not Monaco <laughs> Monaco 57 7 I'm probably not gonna beat it especially not on the first try um, let's do the let's go through the steps let's do free practice and the qualifying then we'll actually race and if I get bored, maybe we'll... Well, there might not be any way of beating your record because I can't tune my car. We'll see. We'll see. And I'm probably not going to beat you because of this uh, the lead-up thing. Oh, wrong button. <laughs> Let's go! I've played this before, I swear. Uh, no, too far. We got it. Ooh, there's a tight turn. And another tight turn. Uh. Not bad, not bad. Oh, not good. Yeah, but I, I really do like the music in this game. Um, I'm not sure how many songs there are. There's at least four or five. Well, minute and a half on the last one. That wasn't very good. way too early on that one oh too far again not used to that that was a little bit beyond 90 degrees not used to that and then this is a doozy man that that s curve well, i was not paying attention oh Something that's uh, cool about this is the uh, um, too early again. <laughs> Gosh, um, is the rear view mirrors? They aren't three D. They actually do sprites, and we'll probably see that once we do an actual race. But uh, those are a lot of fun. They did a lot of tricks to get this to run as fast as it does, and it struggles. Um, something that is a little frustrating is how inconsistent the frame rate can be. Um, you think with a racing game that even if it's a slow frame rate they would do their best to uh, uh, keep it consistent but I, I honestly don't know how difficult oh, darn it too early again um, honestly don't know uh, how difficult it is to program stuff like that oh, that was a little bit better than the last couple times <laughs> Oh, yeah, that's 
curve is bad. See if I can take that one at full speed. <laughs> I tried. I tried and then I died. That's from a movie. Can't remember which one though. <laughs> uh, oh, you have the world record? Oh yeah, so there's no way I'm gonna beat that. <laughs> I'm certainly not terrible. I can I can stay in first place. <laughs> At least in this uh, practice. I don't know how good the... Ah, darn it, too early again. I'm having a hard time with that first curve. Uh, too late on that one. I don't know. Come on, come on. Get back on the road. There we go. Ooh. Problem is, is going off the road has a huge effect on your speed. Anything but that dark asphalt, which I don't know if that'd be true to real life, but ooh, nice. Oh, a little late on that one again. Ah, too much. Sometimes you just have to let off the gas a little bit. Sometimes you have to give it a little bit of break and let off the gas. Okay, let's see if we can do this one. Oh, no, no. Oh, I clipped through it. Good. <laughs> so uh, I've noticed something in this game. The collision is uh, kind of hit or miss, um, especially with other cars. It's actually a lot more liberal than I think it would be, but oh, darn it. Oh, I'm going to get past. Oh. I think I hit him. That's why he's not ahead of me. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, not doing good now. <laughs> oh, boy. This may be my worst lap. Oh, well, that was better. Ooh, yeah, yeah. Man, maybe I shouldn't look at the map so much. <laughs> Just trust my eyes. Uh, oh, definitely not my best. You can try Germany. My lap record is a minute 36.7. It will be much easier than uh, Monaco. Yeah, Monaco was rough. It was really rough. I only played uh, US, USA and then the next track, whatever is that after that yesterday. And so I'm a little more familiar with those. Oh, okay. Oh, anybody else in the chat? Good morning if you just came in. We're, we're doing some racing this morning. This is a little bit of torture for me, so I hope you enjoy it. <laughs> I'm kidding, it's not that bad. Um, I'm just trying to think, like, I really like, uh, I really like F-Zero X, uh, Nintendo 64. I love that game. Uh, the Super Nintendo one's pretty good, too. I prefer the Game Boy Advance version of that, and I say version because the Game Boy Advance version is very similar to, to the Super Nintendo version. Um, I actually like Atari Karts. Uh, here on the Jag. I think that one's uh, fun. Definitely not the best kart racer ever, but it's it's good. Um, what else? I do like Mario Kart 64. I've never... I've, I've tried I've tried other Mario Karts since then, but I grew up with it, and so there's a lot of nostalgia bi bias here. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, what else? That's pretty much it. Those are the only racers I, I really enjoy. Like, I don't mind Wipeout. Oh, oh, one I really love is uh, Ridge Racer on the PSP. That is such a fun game. Um, I love drifting in that game. It is just the right level of arcade racing for me. Uh, this one isn't bad, though. World Tour Racing is pretty good. So you said Germany. Let's give that one a try. Uh, 
Germany. I'm trying to remember if there was anything interesting in the manual. I read through most of it. Um, I don't think it's a pretty straightforward manual. There are a few typos I noticed. Uh, race weekend. Oh, actually, I didn't see that. Race weekend menu. Free practice. I'm on time. Player starts in the pit lane. The car is guided out by the computer. The player takes over once out on the track. You can customize your tires, wings, brakes, and gearbox in this mode. See workshop. We're going to have to do a championship here after I do a couple of these races. Um, I did not do that yesterday, so that will be a little bit of a learning experience. Germany. Germany. Gosh, I'm just checking the aspect ratio on the stream because that image in the circle was way skewed, but that was on their side, so I think we're fine. Um, should we go? Let's just go to qualifying, and then maybe we'll do the race after. Honestly, I use manual gearbox and give you much better results. Yeah, I imagine it does. I've, I've found in most racing games that I have played that do give you the option for manual, it, it tends to be a bit better, but there is a a learning curve to that and so I'm avoiding that today. Maybe we'll try it out in the championship. Oh, wrong button again. Gosh, I'm not good at this. <laughs> I was holding the brake again. Oh, come on. This isn't just going to be a straight line the whole time. Ah, there we go. There's our curve. Not too early. That's okay. We'll be safe. We'll be safe. Got it. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like I have training wheels back on. This this is good. This is good. Ooh, don't get nervous. It's a gentle curve. Hold down the accelerator. Oh, ah, nice. Oh, a little too much. Too much break. Yeah, this one's easier than USA <laughs> so far, except when I do stuff like that. We done a lap yet? Oh no, we haven't. This one's a lot longer than USA. Oh darn it! There we go. There's our lap. What was your time on this? One thirty-six. Oh yeah, I wasn't even close to that. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> My turn around. I may have turned around. No, I think I'm, I'm going the right direction. No second prize is great, especially a Mega ST. I don't think I've ever played No Second Prize. Um, I've seen video of it. Looks awesome. That's the one when you play with the mouse, right? You're on the bikes. Pretty sure that's the one. I've seen footage of it. That one would be awesome to play. I didn't grow up with it. Didn't have a copy. Um, heard it's really good though. Um, One bite cake, welcome to the stream. I didn't notice that you said I thought it was somebody else, but um, well, one bite cake, you would know if we grew up with it, right? I just don't remember ever having that. Okay, so yeah, it is the one with the bikes. Maybe we had it and I just wasn't interested. <laughs> I can't remember. Would any of you be interested in some Atari ST here at the Jag Corner? <laughs> I do have an ST. It's just a 520 with a one megabyte upgrade. Um, so we could play some games on it. Um, I've been thinking about streaming that one because I can get an RGB out on that and plug it into my my line doubler here and it should look great. Should, I haven't done it yet. I haven't tested it, so I'm not entirely sure. 
Oh, this is the nice thing about racing games. I feel like it can talk more. <laughs> okay, yeah, I don't remember ever playing that one. I did it again on that corner. <laughs> I'm paying attention. Oh no, keep going. This is a qualified race. Pay attention. Hunter of Thunderhawk. I'm not familiar with those. Got to. I got to admit, my my repertoire on the ST is a little more narrow. Eh, well, that was way too much break. But we got around the corner without hitting anything. Let's see if we can stay ahead of this guy. Um. But there's a lot of games I've played. Um, you know, through emulation, and when I was a kid, too, when we had an actual ST with a whole lot of bootleg software. Uh, <laughs> but that was kind of the thing with the ST, right? Let's see if we can keep this guy behind me. Uh, nope. Darn it. Okay. I'm going to focus. I'm going to focus really hard. <laughs> see if we can get ahead of this guy again. Yeah, yeah, you take the outside. Stay ahead of this fool. Nice, nice. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Ha ha ha. Oh. Oh, don't hit the wall. Whew. Well, three more laps of this. Let me pause for a second. Who would get... We could get going backwards on the track on purpose just so we could have really high speed collisions. I I think I remember that now. <laughs> broom on ST. Broom. Uh, I played on Mega ST and even TT. See, and I think I might be mixing things up now. Uh, I got to I gotta look this up because I'm gonna sound really stupid. Here, let's do YouTube. Vroom Atari ST. Okay, I'm not mixing things up. So, um, second prize is the 3D one with the bikes. Okay, I was just making sure. I don't know. I don't think I've ever played Vroom. It's very much like, uh, what was that? Outrun? Uh, it's that kind of Mode 6 stuff. Uh, Spy, uh, not Spy Hunter. Um, Cyber Cop. That's the one. Uh, I played that was kind of similar to this, but this one obviously looks a lot better. Oh no, this isn't Mozik. This is actual poly or yeah, this is actual. Well, kind of looks like that raster trick, but it has polygons, which looks really cool. But yeah, um, second prize. I gotta keep <laughs> looking at the name. I keep forgetting it. This is why I think I didn't play it when I was younger. But I I I've seen footage of it. Yeah, but I, I think I do remember um, siblings playing this and running into each other. That seems familiar to me. Oh, go to an outside view. Or maybe maybe it was just the attract mode that was outside. That looks so cool. Yeah. How much RAM do you need to play this? Do you need two megabytes? Can't remember. Anyways, let's get back to it. Oh, that corner is nasty. <laughs> I was not prepared for that. No, nope, you're staying behind me. Yeah, look at those rearview mirrors. Isn't that cool? These sprites. <laughs> Every frame counts on the Jag. Nice. That was way better than previous laps. There we go. Try Vroom video. Yeah, yeah Vroom. I don't think I've ever played Vroom. Ooh. Come on. This is straight away, Will. No, it's, you're staying behind me, bud. Not, nah, not. Nah. <laughs> there we go. 
this might be better to play on a unmodified controller now that I'm thinking about it. I'm playing on my, my clicky controller, my uh, one with the stick. And it's nice. Come on, catch up with them. This is a bad sign because on the later laps. Ah, ah, out of my way. Okay, we got a tight turn here. Nice, nice, not bad. Not bad. No. There we go. Not bad. Let's see if we can get this turn a little bit better this time. There we go. Nice. A little slow, but we got it. I may beat my best on this. We'll see. I feel like I've been handling it a little bit better. Oh, except when that happens. There we go. Ooh. I'll let go on that accelerator a little bit on that turn. Not bad. That was good. Whew. Wasn't as good as last time. Uh, neither was that one. Should have given it just a little bit of break. Ah, darn it. There we go. There we go. Not quite as good as my best. Hmm. Definitely didn't do that one as good as last time, man. Uh, oh, thanks. Thanks. I'd like to beat that 146. I think I can do that here. Keep it above a hundred on those turns, which I know I can. I just have to break at the right time, turn at the right time, get in the right position. Well, I don't think I'm gonna beat my best this time. But we will qualify. I thought that these were three laps apiece. Maybe the qualifying's are five, I don't know. I know there's an option to switch that, but I think that just affects arcade. Can't remember. I <laughs> can't remember. I was fiddling around with it yesterday. Mm, there we go. Well, we got about 20 seconds left. Oh, too late. Too late on the break. Man, seems like it wants you to do the break no matter what, or you just you slide. Yeah, I, that was terrible. Ugh. I choked. I choked at the end. Yeah, that was really bad. That may have been my worst lap. Nah, those other ones where I was hitting that corner really, really hard were probably my worst. <laughs> Why is my... No. 
I was saying Bullet 21, okay. I was thinking your name was Boyd 21, but it's Bullet 21. Well, let's see here. What is this? Grid positions. Oh, yeah, we were doing grid positions. That's right. Oh, I'm in last place because I had a terrible lap or something. Okay, let's do the actual race this time. Let's stop that. Don't need that. Oh, I just realized my chat's all screwed up. One second. On the stream. There we go. That looks better. Okay. Now that I already have a poor start, let's go. Not bad, not bad. Keep it up. Show these fools what's for. Ah, oh, darn it. <laughs> I was hoping I didn't have to do any break on that turn, but that's okay. We didn't lose a lot. We just spun around in the air for a second. <laughs> Yay, we're not in last. Yay, we're not in second for last. We can at least say that. Yeah, yeah. We got it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Not bad, Will. Not bad. Not bad. Oh, see if we can catch up to seventh. Got a long straightaway. Should be able to do that, right? Right? I like the sparks that come out of the back every once in a while. It's pretty cool. Yeah. There we go. Ah. 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 Darn it. we got to get ahead of these guys soon. It seems like first, second, and third always pull ahead. Oh, darn it. Pull ahead, um... Pretty after the first or second lap, they pull ahead of from everybody else fairly quickly. So, oh, darn it! I'm not doing good. Still better than my last lap. The last, oh darn it! That corner <laughs> right in the beginning. So used to there being more of a straightaway there. Uh. Oh, too far. There we Oh, come on. Just let me get ahead of him. Thank you. Thank you. We're finally in seven. Took us a lap to do it, but we did it. Let's see if we can pull ahead of the rest of these guys. Ah, come on. We got him. We got him. Come on. Nope. 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 Ah, get on the other side. There we go. Eh, yeah, eh, yeah. let me, let me, thank you. Hey, we're in fifth. Slightly better than last. Nice. Got it. Oh, too slow, too slow. Way too slow. Uh. The track is beginning to become familiar. <laughs> oh my goodness, that, that put me in fourth by ramming that guy. Nice. Third. Come on. We're going to get at least second. Ha! <laughs> 
<laughs> I can focus. Not screw up these turns too badly. We'll get this. Catching up to him quick. Got him. Ha <laughs> ha. We're first. There we go. Just if I can prevent myself from screwing up these this last thirty seconds. Uh that was oh too much. Turn too much. Oh, you're not getting ahead of me. Well, maybe you are now. No, there it goes first. We may have lost it. We got one more turn to get it back. Yeah, and I, I botched it. We may lose second, too. Ah, we got first. Or second, I mean. We got second. Not bad. Oh, I can't believe I watched World Tour Race uh, World Tour Racing stream in 2022. You made my day. Thank you. Nice race. Thanks, Bullet 21. Yeah, this is this is a lot more fun than I remember it for sure. My uh, next oldest brother used to play this quite a bit. Uh, he actually bought this late in the 90s. Is I know it was a few years. It had to be at least a few years after the Jag was was done. Um, but yeah, I remember him playing it quite a bit. I was just too little to be any good at it. So, any volunteers to create a steering wheel peripheral for the Jag? Oh no. Um, gosh, would that be any good with this game? Because this is built for digital input. I guess you could do a digital steering wheel. It would just be on and off, left, right. <laughs> I don't know. Second place, first loser. Uh, 142. Hey, that was a good lap, though. I got the best lap. Oh, no, 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 no. Sorry. Nelsona got the best lap. Wait, how does that work? Second. Okay, best laps are on the right. There we go. Yeah, I did not get a good lap at all. I'm not even on the list. Oh, that's sad. Jag has digital controls. No need for steering wheel. Oh, you already you already said it, Bullet. <laughs> It'd be cool to see if they if there's hidden code in here for uh, an analog steering wheel, and you can only use it on like half the Jags because <laughs> there's a lot of Jags that don't have that. Uh, what is it called? Oh, it's analog something. There's a chip on there that's actually used for that input. But um, one second, I gotta fix something here. So I kind of have a I have a new setup going on on uh, in front of me where I have the chat right below the monitor now, and I'm just running the stream down there to read the chat. But you have best second best lap. Nelson is your team. Nelsona is your team. Oh, cool! I did not know I was paired up with anybody. That's awesome. Oh, I I wait. How does that Santosi? With Schneider, Schneider, Pressman, and Santosi. There is something I don't understand about this. But first, not second. Yeah, yeah, I see that. I see I, I'm, I'm second, 24 points. And then Nelsona got the best lap, and so we're paired up somehow. I don't, I don't understand that. I don't watch Grand Prix, so I'm not I'm not familiar with the sport at all. So, well, what's this? Race again? Nah. Okay, let's move over to Championship and see if we can get um, our butts handed to us there. Ooh, look at that silver cup! I want that. You are second, but you have the best lap. Okay, awesome. First, first race. Enter code. Ooh, so this is how they do save games. 
What's this standing? Let's go take a look at that. There probably won't be anything here, right? Nelsona Masters, Nelsona. Okay, yeah, so there won't be anything here yet, except for that 24. I don't understand that number either. Maybe I should look at the manual. It probably had to do with qualifying, right? Mm, let's see if it talks about it. First, second, 10 points. Or is that points? It's probably points, huh? Points are awarded to the player based on his finishing position according to the official Formula One rules. The points are totaled after each race towards the driver's championship. The winner is the driver with the most points at the end of the season. In the event of a tie, the winner is the driver with the most race wins. After each race, the player is shown his race results and then his championship position. An option is available to save the game via a code number system at the end of each race. Arcade. Yeah. Okay. Not worried about that right now. Let's do our first race. See if we can really botch things up by uh, modifying our car in a very stupid way. Let's see here, can't you? So you just hit option, right, or something. Let's go straight to the... Let's just do the race on this because I think I can get the first place um, on USA. I've played it enough if, I, if my brain uh, naturally remembers things. So I'm gonna have to figure out how to modify my car. We'll read the manual after this race and get it figured out. This does not look like USA. Well, maybe, maybe it is. Well, off to uh, not the worst start. Like, I'm, I'm holding the gas down, so definitely not the worst start. <laughs> Three laps to get used to this again. Maybe I should do five laps on these races. <laughs> Gives me an opportunity to get used to it. And in this case, get used to it again. Ooh, ooh, too much break. He could have taken that a bit faster. <sighs> oh yeah, that's right. Turning this way for the, for the flag. Fifth place. Not bad, not bad. Oh. A little too, too late on that one. Out of my way. If I was doing 15 laps, I'd do pit stops and stuff like that, but that does not make sense with three laps. That turn was not terrible, nor was that one, nor was that one. You may catch up the first here. Ooh. Well, was, in terms of speed, that was only slightly better than the first lap. At least I didn't have any cars to contend with. Let's see if we can get ahead of this fool. Oh, no, so much for that. If I stayed stayed on the pavement, I probably would have gotten ahead of him. That was a little bit better. Back on the pavement, thank you. Back on the pavement. Yeah, yeah. First place is right there. I don't screw this up. Oh, that was not good. I know I can take that turn at 150 or 130 at least. Ooh. Yeah. We'll be lucky to get first here. Oh, we may do it though. We may do it. Oh, he spun me. Well, 
It was close. Very close. Maybe I should have done a qualifying on that one. It would have made the difference. Uh, I think you can add some textures to track if you press 8, but it will impact the frame rate. Oh, is it that simple? Oh, yeah, there it is. Ooh, texture. I kind of like that. Yeah, we'll try playing it a little bit with the texture. I thought I thought the code was a little more complicated than that. I was aware of it, but second place again. Let's see here. How long do I want to play? I started late, right? So we'll play probably for another thirty minutes or so. See how many championship things we can get through. Nice driving. Steve Atari 71, good to see you. Um, it was, uh, yeah, it wasn't that terrible, right? You can drive as a bus? What? You can drive as a bus? Oh, somebody looked that code up. We got to do that. Oh, there's my save code. Hmm, thank goodness we have cell phones nowadays. I may do that if I play tomorrow. Let's do another race. Next race. Uh, Hungary. Yeah, somebody look that up. We're going to drive as a bus in one of these races. Let's, let's do a qualifying race, see if we can get a little bit further in the start off. Five laps. Here we go. Oh, I should pay attention. There we go. <laughs> I thought it would take a little bit longer to get out on the track. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Not bad, not bad. I think I have played Hungary once. I think I did yesterday, just once. Ha, ah, that was awesome. That was a good. That was not so good. There we go. You know, something I didn't notice before is the clouds. They fade in out of the distance and everything. That's cool. Neat little detail. There are some cool little details in this game. Um, I notice also in tunnels, the audio changes. I mean, it doesn't sound realistic still, but they understood that when you go into a tunnel, the audio should change, um, which is pretty cool. Come on, back on the road. Ooh, look at that textured road. Isn't that awesome? Oh, too hard. Come on. Uh, that was terrible. Uh, why are you blocking people on here, William? You're about to get federal complaint. Oh, hello, 1080p. You're welcome to be on stream, as long as you don't start anything. Race as bus hold for while selecting race as bus Races bus. Hold four while selecting the race or qualifying option. Change the camera view to chase two. Selection to view the bus. Okay, let's go. Yeah didn't hit a wall nice uh, we got it that was good that was really good Oh, that was terrible. <laughs> that wasn't good at all.
Yeah, I think I did play this one yesterday. That's why I'm a little more familiar with it. I thought I just did USA, but I may have done another one. There we go. Wait a second. I'm in fifth? Oh, man. Oh, no, this is a qualifier, right? That's how it works. So it's a little bit different. If I remember correctly. Maybe I am in fifth. Maybe I've been doing really poorly. Too much break. Too much break. Got it. Nice, nice. That was good too. Awesome. That one was not so good. <laughs> Whew. My hands are getting tired. Nice, nice. Not perfect, but serviceable. Gosh, those subtle turns are worse than the 90 degrees. Oh, that's your position, isn't it? In in the context of qualifying, right? So maybe this qualifying thing was kind of pointless now that I'm thinking about it. Uh, that was a little bit better than last time. Nice. Nice. Not nice. <laughs> Ooh. Too much. Too late. Too much break. around you bud oh no yeah 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 let's watch the road well <laughs> I got position nine better than the last position we'll try race now should I do it with the bus <laughs> 
Should we do it with the bus? Oh, where are you, player one? There I am. Oh, 112. That was my best lap. And we got position nine. Well, was it worth the time? Probably not. Um, let's do this. I'm going to do... Uh, okay, okay, let's do it. So, uh, let's hold four while selecting race or qualify option. Change the camera view to the chase two selection to view the bus. And to change my camera view to C, if I remember correctly. So, we'll give that a try. Oh. No, I think I already screwed up. Yeah, I already screwed up. Let's see if I can start over. It's probably going to completely abandon my qualifying position, too. That's okay. That's pushing seven, not not a not a four yeah. well steve that was your last chance goodbye Okay, let's try this again. Uh, next race? Okay, oh, well, it's sending us to Germany. Oh, this should be fun. <laughs> okay, four. Holding up four. And then chase two. Oh, well, we saw it there for a second. Come on. One more. There we go. Go, Mr. Bus. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I was hoping there was one a little bit further out. One more. Come on. You got it. One more. Go out. Come on. Come on. There we go. There we go. We got the bus. We can't see anything, but we got the bus. Mm. Got to just keep an eye on the map, see if we can catch up to everybody. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, got it. <laughs> now, the real challenge is to beat this game every race, first place, with the bus. Let's see somebody uh, speed run that or something. <laughs> well, I know this guy's around me somewhere. See if we can not come in last. That would be impressive. Imagine an actual Formula Formula One race with, uh, um, with <laughs> and there's an actual bus racing against everybody, and you lose to the bus. Oh, that would be sad. No, oh, too much, too much. Come on. Let's try to get eighth. We can do that, right? We can do that. We can catch up to eighth here. Not bad for a bus. Oh, we hit him. Darn it. Ah. Well, at least that doesn't hurt us too much.
We got seven. Let's see if we can get six. Nice. <laughs> we got six. Now going for fifth. You know, boss. Ah, nice. Hey, I saw buses on the side there. <laughs> There's a whole team of them. Wish there was a code that would turn everybody into a bus. That would be awesome. Nice, 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 nice. Man, we may get into the top three here. Of course, this, this track has been a little bit easier than most. Hey, we got third. Nice. Ah, out of my way. I want first. <laughs> There we go. Final lap. First is within our grasp. Ha <laughs> ha! First. Okay, but can I keep it? Man, with a straightaway like this. Give me a lot of buffer. Nice. 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 I think we have this in the bag. be cool if they add just a little bit of tipping action in the bus when you did turns that would be awesome Ugh. well we're past the halfway point That's not good. That was not good. Braked a little too early on that one. We got this. We got this. A couple more turns. Oh, no. Too late. Should have been watching the road. What was that message? No front wing. Oh, no. I lost my wing. <laughs> one more turn. Or a few more. Another one up here. We got it though. Even without it. No, 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 no. You're not getting ahead of me. No, I got second place. <laughs> Darn it. <laughs> oh, that was close. Oh. Nice bus racing. Yeah, that was awesome. Wait a second. I think there's a car hiding in that bus. Those polygons are not doing their job. Those beautifully textured polygons. Well, <laughs> yeah, that was a great finish, wasn't that? <laughs> Who would have thought a front wing would cause that many problems? I guess if it was like sliding under my wheel or something, that'd be an issue. All right, I think that's enough for today. I love how you can see the original car. <laughs> yeah, they literally, they're like, eh, let's not pull it out. Let's just drop this cardboard box of a bus on top of the on top of the car <laughs> probably could have saved a few frames if they'd gotten rid of the, you know my tires there but anyways that was awesome hey i totally forgot about that bus thanks for bringing that up uh bala 21 
That was awesome. So cool. Well, should we do more of that tomorrow? Maybe maybe what I'll do tomorrow, maybe we'll do a little bit of power drive rally and a little bit of Atari carts. So I think I have one of my Jags has a problem has a problem with music on Atari carts. It has some issues. And I think I have one of my good Jags here for that. So I think we can do that without any problems. So but anyways, or we can do more world tour racing. Let me know. Um or if you want to, if you're interested, we can do some more programming. I do have some stuff lined up for that, but I figured I can I do two days of programming one week and two days of gaming the next week. I kind of like that. It's kind of a natural groove that I found, so maybe we'll just do that. But anyways, um, yeah, if there's nothing else, but yeah, I, I really enjoy Power, Power Drive Rally. Um, this is really good too, though. I've, I've been enjoying this a lot more than I thought I would. Uh, there's There's been... Um, there has been some conversations on Atari age and world tour racing kind of gets, uh, uh, talked in a bad light quite a bit. Um, it's obviously compared to modern racers, it's not good at all, but for its time, it's definitely playable. It's serviceable as they would say. Um, and I've actually really been enjoying it. This has been good, especially with that bus. That's awesome. I want to try to do, uh, uh, come up with some goals and see how many <laughs> races I can beat with the bus. <laughs> That'd be fun. Um, oh, I should have turned the texture mapping off on the road. That may have sped it up a little bit. There was obviously a frame rate drop with the bus and with the texture mapping. T with the texture mapping, it isn't quite as noticeable. But um, you know, tomorrow we'll do some Power Drive Rally and maybe some Atari Karts. Uh, maybe we'll just focus on Power Drive Rally because I, I really do enjoy that game. I, I'm nowhere near as good as with power drive rally it seems like it's a little more difficult than this is i don't know this is difficult if you actually want to get consistently first place and again i haven't played all the tracks i imagine there's some like that morocco or monaco monaco uh track was was pretty difficult i wasn't used to that at all and i imagine there's more tracks like that but anyways well i'm off everybody uh kevin buffalo bullet 21 um who else was on one bite cake uh, i don't want to miss anybody uh yeah thanks for joining me and matt smith you were here too it's good to see you um i uh, and uh steve atari 71 uh hopefully he won't be too much of a problem in the future he's somebody that uh I don't, I don't, I don't want anybody to dogpile on or, or, or hurt him much, but he's, he's caused some issues in the past. And, and so I, I give him a try. I give him a chance each time, but as soon as he makes trouble, I, I'm going to block him. So hopefully that doesn't happen too much in the future, but everybody else, thanks for joining. Uh, and thanks. Yeah. Thanks for racing with me. Thanks for showing me or reminding me about the bus. That was great. And, uh, we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.